Hello everyone. Today we'll discuss about the national organizations. This is also one of the very important topic as per the exam perspective. You can see the previous year question papers. Most of the questions have been arrived from this organization. So that's why I have choose this topic today. So please watch till end and make a note of it. Okay, let's start. Reserve Bank of India (RBI) has been established in 1935 in accordance with the provision of the Reserve Bank of India Act 1934. Its headquarters is in Mumbai, Maharashtra. Initially, it was established in Kolkata. but later it is permanently moved to the mumbai the present chairman of the rbi is shaktikant das shaktikant das is the present chairman of the rbi rbi has been established through the recommendation of the hilton young commission remember hilton young commission the objective of the rbi is to formulate and implement the monetary policy and issue the currency and maintain its stability and rbi act as a bankers bank and it controls the credit through the crr repo rate and open market operations rbi also focus on ensuring the orderly conditions in foreign exchange market Okay next we'll see Securities and Exchange Board of India SEBI SEBI has been established in 1988 as a non statutory body but it has established as the uh, statutory body through the 12th April 1992 You might get confused in examination whether to tick the option this or this they will give an option like either this or this if they given both they will mention the it is non statutory it as statutory body if they have asked the question as a when the sebi has established as a statutory body then you should tick the option which has 1992 it is a non statutory body have established in 1988 next its headquarter is present in mumbai maharashtra and the present chairman of this sebi is madabi puri but the objectives are it regulates the securities market in india and it also protect the interest of investors in securities it protect the interest of investors in securities and the sebi prevents the fraudulent practice and malpractice which are related to the trading and regulation of the activities of stock exchange okay next we'll see about the national bank for agriculture and rural development nabada it is established in 1982 it is headquarter is present in the mumbai The present chairman of this Nabada is Shaji K V. We'll see the objectives of this Nabada. It promotes the sustainable and equitable agriculture and rural development, and it provides the credit for agriculture and other economic activities in rural areas. What are the objectives? it promote the sustainable and equitable agriculture and rural development and it provide the credit for agriculture and other economic activities in rural areas and it also provides the credit for the small scale industries and cottage industries and other rural crafts okay next we'll see about the Insurance Regulatory and Development Authority of India IRDAI 
it is founded as a statutory body in 1999 it is headquarter is present in hyderabad telangana the present chairman of this irdi is devashish panda and its objective is to regulate and promote the insurance industry and protect policy holders interest and it also does the speedy settlement of genuine claims and effective grievance redressal mechanism and it also promotes the fairness and transparency next we'll see about the telecom regulatory authority of india trai it is founded in 12th february 1997 its headquarters is present in new delhi the present chairman of the telecom regulatory authority of india is anil kumar lahoti and the objective is to regulate the telecommunications services and ensure the fair competition and protect the consumer interest see it protects the consumer interest and it broadcasting and cable services which will enable india to play a leading role in emerging global information society next we'll see about the food safety and standards authority of india fss ai it is founded in august 2011 its headquarters is present in new delhi it comes under the ministry of health and family welfare the present chairman of the fss ai is apurva chandan and its objective is to ensure the food safety and regulate the manufacture storage and distribution sale and import of food items to the to promote public health and it also provides the scientific advice and technical support to the central government and state governments in a matters of framing the policy and rules in areas which have direct or indirect bearing of food safety and nutrition it provides scientific it provides the scientific advice to central and state government next we'll see about the national highways authority of india nhai it is established in 1988 it, its headquarters is present in the new delhi it comes under the ministry of road transport and highways the present chairman of the nhai is santosh kumar yadav the objective is to develop and maintain the national highways and implement the highway development projects and ensure the safe and efficient movement of traffic okay next we'll see about the isro indian space research organization it is established in the 15th august 1969 isro's headquarters is present in bangalore karnataka it comes under the ministry of department of space and government of india the present chairman of this isro is s somnath chairman is s somnath the objective is to harness the space technology for national development and conduct the space exploration satellite development and launch missions it also functions in the areas of broadcasting weather forecasting disaster management and the geographic information systems navigation etc next we'll see about the drdo defense research and development organization it is established in 1958 its headquarters is in new delhi it comes under the ministry of defense the present chairman of this drdo is 
Samir V. Kamath. We'll see the objective of this DRDO. Develop the technologies and products for the enhancing defense capabilities and it innovate in defense technology and support the national security. Its objective is to develop the technologies and products for the enhancing defense capabilities and it innovates in defense technology and it also supports the national security. Next we will see about the Food Corporation of India FCI. It is established in 1965. Its headquarters is present in New Delhi. It comes under the Ministry of Consumer Affairs and Food and Public Distribution. The present chairman of this FCI is Ashok Kumar Meena. Ashok Kumar Meena. We will see the objective of this FCI. The objective is to ensure the food security through the efficient procurement, storage, distribution and supply food grains under the public distribution system. The objective of FCI is to ensure the food security through the efficient procurement, storage, distribution and supply of the food grains under the PDS system. Okay, that's all about the uh, national organizations. I have chosen only a important national organizations which are a very important in the exam perspective. Okay, I hope all of you have understood this topic. If this video helps you in any way, please subscribe, like, share and comment. Thank you.